Welcome back everybody. Everybody's golf on PlayStation 4. We're playing Imperial Garden, the Inward 9, as an open course today. Just going to play the nine holes. Nope, not the one. Just check in the, the cups and the, and the wind, which are both normal today. So we're going to use our custom clubs and the standard ball. So par four to start. Pretty much straight down the middle, I think. Yeah, we've got plenty of length, so we can we can lay up into there. But I think actually we'll give it the beans and just back off a little bit, see if we can stop it, give ourselves a decent approach. You could hit over to the left, but no need. And that's not bad. Oh, nice shot. Should just take that bunker out of play and just end our yeah position A. So it leaves us 98 yards. Wind's just from behind us, a little bit uphill. Lies quite flat. Let's just hit it. Is that a little bit too little, Paramount? Is that gonna land? Good, good. Oh, that's not bad. That's ah, three foot pop. I'm happy with that. Chance for a birdie. Breaking to the left. And the putt just gonna break a little bit to the left. Oh, there we go. Nice Betty to start us off. So, over the lock gate, back into the wind this time, but again, the wind's not really anything to worry about. The real worry is getting a good position on this fairway. So we'll go for the power shot. Oh, missed the power. So we'll lose a tiny bit of length there. Should still be all right. Yeah, and then it should just bring us back round a little bit. That's okay. So 130 to go. Straight into the wind. It's a little bit downhill. That bunker. That bunker. We might just put a bit of shape on it just to kind of take it a little bit out of play. Miss the impact. Where's that going to go? Yeah, in the sand is the answer. But hopefully I can get that up and out. So, 20 yards to go. But of course, it's, um, it's an approach shot, so we're going to get the altitude. Okay, let's get it up and out. We got it up. Looks like we got it out. I'll be a bitch. Oh, it went in. <coughs> well, how'd you how'd you like that? I can't believe it. I'll take that. I thought I'd left that short. So that's a decent chip in eagle. I'll take it. That's a decent start on it. It's a hold twelve. Home of the water skip. Now, is that reachable is the question. But you know what? Because previously I've played over to here. In fact, you see my best drive marker just there. Because previously we haven't had the length. However, comma. But you know what? We might give this a crack. We might give this a crack. We're going to have to go round the tree, mind you. Yeah. Oh, nice. Well, actually, you can just about clear over the tree. Good bounce. Now, it's getting up in the sand. Oh, no, stay, 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 stay. Oh, that's all right. Right. So it's going to fly a little bit right, and then it's going to come back to the left when it lands. How's that? Ah, oh, it's okay. It's okay. So we got a birdie pup. I mean, it's the unconventional way to get your birdie, but I'll take it. There we go. Okay, so another par four. Ah, it's a par four. It's a spindly fairway again. Now, I could just get this. Do you know what? We might just go for this. Hopefully, I've read the wind. Masterful. 
Go on. Go on. So what about where it lands? Yeah. Just going to roll off, I think. Oh, just holds. So, 30 yards to go. Wind will take it back a little bit. Masterful. Oh, it's going to be a bit short. Roll with it. Go for the birdie. Okay, so breaking left to right. Looks like it slopes up. A little bit uphill. Probably to the right. Three quarters of a cup left. And hit it reasonably. Should just break back center. Of it. I'll take it. So that's a decent start. Five under. Ball fourteen is a par three. Okay, par three into the wind. Reasonable pin. Okay. Maybe just a bit too much power on it, but it might be all right. I just wanted to make sure I got it up and not in that bunker. Yeah, it's a little bit too much power, but better than the other option. Powered up with three out of it as well. Go for the birdie. Okay. Looks like it slopes up. It's pretty even to start, then breaks towards the end. And needs a firm hit. Break, 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 break. Oh, just didn't break enough. Or a touch too firm. So I'll take my par. That's a missed opportunity, really. But that's long par threes for you. You've got to get them close. Got to get them close. Ball 15. It's a par four. And this is another one that's been tricky in the past. Just in terms of where you drive. Again, we're going to go for it. Oh, it's all about where it bounces. <laughs> the answer wasn't the front face of the bunker. Perversely, not a bad outcome. Still reachable. It's on the front part of that green as well. Okay. Got it out. Got it up. Got it on. I'll take that. For a so, a little bit of break, a little bit downhill. So, Open maybe down, I think. two thirds break. of a cup. Just a little bit soft. Should just break. Yeah. <laughs> Nearly overborrowed there. Okay, 5 3 4 finish. Straight over the green. Okay, again, now we've got the length. We don't have to worry about skipping onto that. We should nicely land there. Especially if I hit the power shot. Oh, neat shot. So should have the legs. Oh, almost took that bunker out of play. It's a decent hit. Nearly 400 yards. Still leaves us 200. And the tricky question about do you lay up? Or do you go for this? Now, five ants. I should be able to stop it. A little bit of a headwind. Well, let's get it up there. Great shot. Hopefully, going to land on the front edge. Ooh. There you go. It kills its speed. That's not bad. Give me eleven footer for a for an eagle. Bit of a severe slope. Sloping uphill. Okay. Breaking to the right. So maybe three cups left and hit it firm. How's that looking? Oh, too soft. The line was good. Just, birdie. just needed a firmer stroke, I think. A okay, it's a par three. Hole seventeen. It's a par three. Again, a nice attackable pin. I've overhit that for sure. Oh, nice shot. So it should land on the green. It's all about what Ooh. it does when it gets on there. Roll with yeah. Go for the bird. Ended up under hit. Okay. 
sloping uphill. So let's go half Welcome a cup left. To the right. Hit it firm. Hopefully that just breaks and lands in the middle. Yeah. Nice birdie. So V with our best score of eight under. See if we can get nine under. It's a powerful. Again, it's a bit of a thin fairway this one, but again, we should be all right. A little bit of shape on it. Yeah, Let's give us a best chance of landing in a good spot. That's not bad. Just runs off into the rough. Might come back. Yeah, Sam ends in the rough. It's Look okay. The gauge closely. So it's going to fly right. Wind will bring it back. We'll lose a bit of power to the lie. Bravo! Oh, wind's caught it. Wind's caught it. Gone right. Yeah, it's just going to end up off. It's all right. It's on the fringe. It's retrievable. So. Cheeky chip into end. Oh, not quite. Just a bit too fierce. Just a bit too fierce. So we'll have to take the par there. We end up with our joint best score of eight under. So a couple of drop shots there, I suppose. Nothing, nothing to get upset about. Daily rivals wise, that won't be that won't be a competitive score. I wouldn't have thought. You'll be seeing 13, 14. The yeah, record 16 on this. I imagine. Yeah, someone got 14. Oh, actually, it's not so bad. Mm. So currently second. We'll see if anyone improves. Stats-wise, I should have a higher points total than last time. No, lower. Interesting. Interesting. Yeah, it was the impact on the fairways, wasn't it? That's the issue. Okay, I hope you enjoyed that. If you did, please like, share and subscribe. And I'll see you next time for a little bit more Everybody's Golf.